wanted to start with compensation philosophy. As an organization, first, you have to decide how you want to pay employees. Do you want to meet the market for non-technical jobs, for example, and lead the market for technical jobs, which is what we commonly see in similar organizations to you all? Meeting the market means typically targeting the midpoint of the range at 50th percentile and then a higher percentile for technical like 65th or 75th at the midpoint, of course, you're going to have a range to fall within that. Typically, of course, the technical jobs are targeted at a higher percentile because they're just harder to find in the market, typically require a special skill set, and so the ranges are targeted higher. Of course, you've got different compensation component levers here. You've got salary, equity, and then variable pay. And you want to look at this every year as far as what philosophy you want to have. For example, last year, when cash might have been short, you might have pulled this lever over to the right more and made equity kind of a bigger component and leveraged it more when cash was short. The reason why you want to review it annually, things change, right? You see patterns in recruiting positions like BI analysts, for example, or ML engineers become harder to find in the market. You notice that. So maybe you need to target 75th percentile for those jobs instead of 65th. You also have different budgets every year and the stage, of course, is different um, year over year.